Okay, uh, welcome back to the Apple School of Knowledge. Today we have to discuss the keeping uh, keeping a record. Yeah, this one, which means that keeping record in business. Okay, so and what are what is the importance of keeping record? And uh, what what are the purposes of keeping record? So let me do it here. Then we'll do the book stuff clear here yeah keeping records and business you know a business maintain detailed record of its financial activity including uh, sales uh, purchases receipt and payment but what what is the importance uh, and, and what is the purposes of keeping these records so the first one <clears throat> and, and, and and you know uh, if you are keeping uh, records then it will be helpful for tracking financial financial obligation what does it mean it means that you know businesses need to monitor their outstanding liabilities to suppliers and the amount owed uh, by the credit customer for example uh, you know a retailer uh, keeps track of the inventory purchases from a supplier and the payment due to them so it will help you in tracking the financial obligation what is the uh, second purpose of keeping the record in business is resolving dispute resolving disputes it means that you know records of sale and purchases are valuable in, uh, uh, in, in resolving dispute with a customer or suppliers uh, for example if a customer claim uh, they were overcharged for a product the businesses can refer to its sale record uh, to verify the transaction uh, transaction detail so in this way you will uh, resolve the dispute uh, which may be between uh, the customer and uh, supplier okay what is the uh, the the the, the, um, the purpose number third uh, which which came in my mind that was ensure integrity and uh, uh, detecting fraud ensuring ensuring uh, integrity and detecting fraud so <clears throat> you know detailed records allow businesses to verify the accuracy of the transaction reducing the risk of errors or fraudulent activity for example you know regular reconciliation of the bank statement with regard to transaction help detect the risk uh, uh, what we call that is a uh, discrepancy clear okay uh, the number four it will also help you monitoring uh, monitoring business performance which means that you know when by maintaining records of the sale purchases and expenses a business can evaluate its financial health and performance for example analyzing monthly sales uh, let's say you are analyzing the uh, monthly sale figure figure then that will help you identify the trend and assist the profitability so in nutshell i will say 
that keeping record and uh, record uh, <clears throat> and business is essential for tracking financial obligation uh, resolving uh, a dispute ensuring integrity uh, and monitoring business performance so detailed records help businesses maintain transparency uh, you know detect errors and make informed decision uh, for example uh, you know uh, we have discussed that uh, sale record purchase invoices bank statement you know these are the record that the business maintain and these records are organized systematically into in a structured ledger accounts is a part of accounting system facilitating financial management and reporting so this is just a uh, nutshell summary of this uh, topic that why the, why the business is keeping the records and you know <clears throat> records keeping is crucial for you know tracking financial obligation which i have told you and also resolving the dispute ensuring integrity so it involves uh, you know maintaining the records of sale purchase and uh, uh, like their expenses petty cash and payroll and so on like that so <clears throat> uh let me show you the book stuff that you have to understand here you see a businesses keeps detailed record of at sale purchases receipt and payment and there are several reasons for keeping the record okay so businesses keeping uh, all all these uh, records like uh, sale purchases receipt and they are reason behind keeping uh, these records and i will say that is the importance of keeping these records so the first one is a business need to keep track of how much it owes to its supplier and how much it owed by a credit customer so for this i will use that it's uh, tracking financial tracking financial obligation so it will help you and the reason is uh, that it will uh, you know help you for tracking your financial obligation clear now this is the first reason reason number second records of sale and purchase are useful useful in the event of query or dispute with a customer so this will also help you in resolving dispute okay if you're keeping the sale and purchase so uh, records then it will be helpful in case of any query or their dispute between customer supply the third reason number third keeping records of transaction means that check can be carried out to make sure that they have been processed honestly and that there have been no mistake or fraud so this is about your uh, integrity the reason is integrity and ensuring ensuring integrity and detecting fraud keeping record of sale purchase and other expenses allow business to monitor how well it's performing and whether it's making profit or loss so for that i will say that the reason is monitoring business performance so the four reason which i have told you is behind this that why the business are keeping the records okay similar reason apply uh, to keeping a petty cash record Federal regard must also maintain to ensure that employees are properly rewarded uh, for their work and ensure that correct deduction are made. It means that you know 
we have already discussed about uh, the petty cash and we have also done with that of the fair roll that you know pet, petty cash <coughs> is also talking about that petty cash management you know man, maintaining records of small every bit uh, every transaction uh, everyday expenses and payroll administration uh, you know recording implied compensation and deduction accurately so this means that you know uh, uh, you, you you when you are maintaining the uh, petty cash records and so it will be easy for you to track the expenses and also payroll record is the same way okay now transaction are recorded in accounts and the system of recording transaction is therefore called accounting system okay so you have to understand that transaction are recorded so all these transactions are recorded in accounts and the system of recording transaction we call it accounting accounting system it means that the system for recording transaction also known as the bookie bookkeeping system so organizing transaction transaction are structured into a set up ledger account for systematic recording so these are the account uh, or bookkeeping system is also called accounting system or bookkeeping system and the system organized transaction to structure ledger account accounting records will be uh, you know we spend letters chapter. So to maintain record it is important to maintain documents and uh, uh, providing evidence for transaction so this means the documentation for evidence here I remember documentation for evidence so importance of documents you know maintaining document is evidence of transaction for accurate record keeping clear good now we have done with the concept and let's do some mcqs clear so if you see here uh, okay here Which of the following is not reason for maintaining detailed records in a business? Tracking apply attendance, resolving dispute. Okay, this is the reason that we are maintaining. Monitoring business performance also a reason. Ensuring honest processing is also a reason. So which of the following is not a reason? Then you have the option tracking apply attendance is not the reason behind keeping uh, you know maintaining or keeping the detailed records so imply attendance tracking is typically managed separately from financial records keeping and it's not directly related to maintaining a detailed business records so the option uh, a is the correct one okay the remaining of the reason that you are keeping the trans uh, business transaction okay here why uh, why is it important to maintain records why is it important to maintain record of sale and purchase in a business why it's important so we have discussed that <coughs> there might be <coughs> possibility of dispute between the supplier and the customer so to resolve dispute with the supplier is the correction the correct answer and that is the, 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 the that is the reason that we are keeping the records of sale and purchase. So records of sales and purchase so is evidence in case of dispute with supply regarding transaction and agreement. Clear? Okay. Now question number third. It says that what is the primary purpose of maintaining petty cash record in a business? Why we are maintaining petty cash uh, record in business? So this is we sample to monitor business expenses. We have to track the expenses. So option number C is the correct one to manage. No, so not this one. Uh, we, we, we say, to monitor B. To monitor business expenses option 
B is the correct one. So pretty cash record help tracking small everyday expenses anchored by the business. Okay. Here. Which term refer uh, refer to the system of for recording transaction in a business? Then we call that as the accounting system or bookkeeping. So accounting system organize and record financial transaction systematically. Option C is the correct one. What is the purpose of maintaining documentation providing evidence of transaction? Here. So what is the purpose of maintaining documentation providing evidence of transaction? So that will be your option B to ensure compliance with the tax regulation. You know documentation service is evidence for ensuring compliance with the tax laws and regulation. Clear? Okay, now six number, uh, MCQ number six, which aspect of record keeping helped ensuring the integrity of transaction? So verification of transaction will, uh, you know, help in ensuring that integrity, integrity of the transaction and then we show that there's no problem activity or problem practice. So verification of transaction uh, will be, uh, you know, the aspect of the regarding keeping help in ensuring the integrity of transaction. So verification of transaction ensure that they have been processed honestly and accurately. Okay, then you have a uh, what role do payroll records play in a business managing employees compensation? So payroll records are used to accurately record and manage employee compensation. Option C is the correct for managing employee compensation. Clear? Good. Now let's move on. We have MCQs number 8. How or transaction organize an accounting system? Then you have option number A and to set up structure ledger account, the accounting system organize transaction into ledger account for a systematic recording and analysis. Okay, then you have the last one that is uh, not last one but uh, MCQ number 9. What is the primary purpose of maintaining record of sale, purchase and expenses? So the primary purpose is to assist the business performance that will let the business go uh, in the right, goes in the right direction or wrong direction. Okay, so what this is the option B is the correct one to assist the business performance. Why is it essential to maintain accurate payroll record in business to ensure that proper reward for the employee work have been avoided? So this is the option number C ensure proper reward for employees work okay so accurate payroll record are essential for ensuring that employees are properly compensated for the work and that correct deduction are made and some other stuff like bonus and so on okay so for today this is enough inshallah we'll continue the next topic in the next lecture thank you